Sharona's hurt ribs. Kuba, I was wondering if you're ever going to let me talk. Mike Sharona and Ben have a change of attitude, and I just want to use this forum right now to send out a personal apology to Big Bad Ben. There was an understanding, a misunderstanding last week. I never said anything derogatory ever about Big Bad Ben. He's always been one of my favorites, Kuba, especially now. I think you're just sucking up the Big Bad Ben so you don't get hurt. We got the icon, Brian Thompson, in the ring, ready to go for tonight's first match. Our first match on GCW is set for one fall. Introducing first from Moe's Tavern, Los Angeles, here is Sam Bacardi. And his opponent, accompanied to the ring by tree from Forest Park, Illinois, here is Johnny Greenpeace. Johnny Greenpeace and Tree, Poobah. They've done more collectively for the environmentalist movement than the Sierra Club and Greenpeace combined, Poobah. The Autobahn Society, Arbor Day, nothing compared to this man, Johnny Greenpeace. You can say that this is uh, somewhat of a rematch here against, well, I don't know, the last time we saw these two men in action, they were tag team partners here against the Super Gestaldis. Johnny Greenpeace did not care for the annex of one Sam Bacardi, and he's looking to really kind of show him who's the big man here in GCW. Well, Bacardi wanted to use a table in the last match, Poobah, and of course, Johnny vehemently opposed to using tables. He doesn't want to see those trees seamlessly die. And now he and Bacardi are going to settle their differences. Big power move there by Sam Bacardi. Or I should say by Johnny Greenpeace on Sam Bacardi. Bacardi's saying he pulled his hair, but Johnny Greenpeace would never do that, Poobah. There's never been a man who was more interested in the concept of fair play than Johnny Greenpeace. Oh, he went, tried to shoulder block. The big man didn't work out. Bacardi is big. He's strong, and he's tough to move. But oh, oh he took his head off Puba with that clothesline. Big, powerful clothesline. Cover and a count of two here. Sean Vincent, your referee in this one-on-one -on -one matchup on GCW Wrestling. Alongside Tommy Jeans, I'm the Grand Puba in the corner. Oh! Oh! Second job. Two chops delivered there by Johnny Greenpeace. Look, Johnny looks like he's a little bit mean tonight, Poobah. Snapmare takeover. He's snarling in there. I've never seen him this angry before. I know. It, it, we're seeing a sadistic side to Johnny Greenpeace that we had not seen before here at GCW. Of course, the last couple of weeks you heard about the political viewpoints here. And Sam McCarty saying, saying it. Oh, my <laughs> goodness. Side headlock. Johnny's in complete control right now, Poobah. Another big clothesline, this time Greenpeace on the receiving end. Yeah, that one hurt him. He's a little bit shaken up right now. That look on his face is one of pain, Poobah. Side headlock here by Sam Bacardi. Big man against the ropes. Johnny Greenpeace, elbow to the chops. Johnny Greenpeace. Big man from Forest Park, Illinois, making his name here in GCW. And I'll tell you what, I'm still kind of shocked. The couple of times that we've seen Johnny Greenpeace in the ring, it's really kind of been an antithesis of what we normally know about Johnny Greenpeace. He's not been a pacifist in the ring at all, Tommy. No, he's, look at the look on his face, Poobah. He's in there in a fight right now, and he's showing that sadistic side that you need to be successful in this sport. Goodness, fall away slam there by, uh, by Johnny Greenpeace. Yeah, how about that, Poobah? Bacardi's about as big as a redwood, and Johnny just chopped him down. Unbelievable. Here's the cover. Two, and nope, didn't even get a two count as Sam Bacardi got his feet on the ropes. Johnny yeah, Bacardi Greenpeace. credit, Poobah. He had awareness of where he was in the ring, and he saved that pinfall. I don't think he could have kicked out. Battle of very big men here in GCW Wrestling and sets them up. Oh my goodness. Kuba. That will probably do it. Here's the hook of the leg. Two and three. Look at the look on Johnny Greenpeace's face. Johnny Greenpeace. Johnny Greenpeace. And now oh. Johnny Greenpeace going into the ring. Taking a hold of a tree. Oh! I'd say Johnny is showing a whole new side, Puba. Disgusting display. Johnny, calm down, please. Johnny, Johnny, please. Using tree. Johnny, what's going on in there? This ain't like you at all. 
No, no, it's just like me. You see, the guy screwed me. He cost me. To quote one of my least favorite movies of all time, you fans of DeSoto need to learn something. Fat, fat, drunk, drunk, and stupid is no way to go through life. Johnny Greenpeace. Unbelievable action there. More GCW action here in just a second. The human wrecking ball Pete Madden who uh, felt betrayed by Big Bad Ben uh, uh, and essentially by the syndicate, Mike Sharona, Big Bad Ben. Another man who we felt got kind of slighted in that uh, falling out in DeSoto was the pretty boy Kevin Sharp. I would like for him to come out here right now. Kevin Sharp. <laughs> Kevin, as always, good to see you again here on GCW Wrestling. Kevin, you, you have some words to say about what happened down in DeSoto. Well, what I want to start out by saying is it's just a great pleasure for you to see me here today because as always, the pretty boy is looking good. Now, to address this moron, this big slob, big bad Ben, hey baby, I understand why you did what you did. You didn't have my back from the start. I understand, I've been out here carrying you around here, saving your butt from them old school wimps running around here, but you know what, that's no more. You jump, you, you want to turn your back on me because I tried to reform the syndicate. You turned your back on me. You know why? Because when you took the belt from Madden, you knew that I was the number one contender. You wanted to knock me out the spot right then and there. But you know what? You didn't get the job done. But here's one thing about it now. You won't have to wrestle me for your title. You're going to have to fight me. And the pretty boy don't lose fights because I'm way too pretty. Strong message there by the pretty boy, Kevin Sharp. More action here on GCW in just a minute.